Video Gamers Oasis. Website, YouTube channel. Mages Initiation Reign of the Elements Hello retro gamers, YouTube fans of Video Gamers Oasis and newcomers. Welcome back to my YouTube channel Video Gamers Oasis and I'm Jeremy back again with another uh, walkthrough of Mages Initiation. We're gonna get through this game. We're gonna, uh, like I mentioned in my previous video, uh, we will continue with the previous um, Minecraft construction handbook reading and uh, tutorial uh, tutorials that I've been doing. But we're going to take a break from that until we finish the Mage's Initiation. This may take to the, uh, to, the end of, to the end of summer. It's a long game, but if I do finish it earlier, I will return to the Minecraft videos. So I hope you're doing well. You're staying healthy, staying safe, staying sane, staying physically fit. Having fun and being honorable with one another? Good. I'm glad you are. Welcome back, and let's get on with some more Mage's Initiation Fantasy RPG uh, retro-style point-and-click adventure game that we've come to love in the uh, in the Amiga games, the Tandy, Tandy games um, around the 80s and 90s. I love these games. Uh, they require a lot of thinking, and they're not so much uh, uh, action-oriented. They're a lot of turn-based, a lot of... Uh, Thinking is involved in these games. I like games that make you think and solve puzzles. Very philosophical games too. If you haven't already, would you be so kind as to like this video? Add it to your favorites, leave comments below, share with all your friends on social media. Would be really appreciated if you would do that for me. Thank you so much. Um, subscribe to Video Gamers Oasis and click the notification bell. Make sure that bell is wiggling and you'll be notified of future videos that I'll be doing. Check out the links below, especially download the Brave Browser. Protect yourself from unwanted spy, spyware, adware, pop-ups. Download the Brave Browser, protect yourself on the internet. As well, you can earn digital tokens by watching the Brave ads that pop up from Brave. They're very, very safe and they're very profitable too. If you watch those ads, you can earn digital tokens. And you can donate your tokens to me, BATs to me. Download the right browser and donate your bats to me after watching the ads. Thank you so much for your support. I really appreciate it. It helps the work that I do on my website, VideoGamersOasis.com, that I'm working on, and the YouTube channel, Video Gamers Oasis. You may have noticed before we get on with the gaming, uh, I have a strange kind of mic headphone and microphone. I'm experimenting with a new kind of uh, headphone microphone system. I don't know how long this is going to last, but just trying something today. Uh, I'm sitting. If you know, haven't noticed, I'm sitting on my, on my new, uh, my new love seat, with a leopard skin, not real leopards, artificial, aesthetic, leopard skin uh, blanket, and I have a little backdrop in behind me, and I wanted to try something new. Uh, I wanted to experiment with playing games, using doing gameplay walkthroughs on my couch. I feel much more relaxed playing games this way. So let's see if we can uh, make this work, eh? Let's see, uh, see guys, we can make this work. So, um, obviously I have to have a new way of holding my microphone. I don't know how much I can hold it like this all the time. This is a bit awkward, but we'll figure something out. All right, um, let's get on with it. Uh, let's continue our adventure, last adventure. We already defeated Amun Kul, the sinister 500 year old priestess. We retrieved the lock of hair. Uh, that's our first mission and we also found Cray, our fellow water mages, uh, Sapphire Brooch. Let's see what our next mission will involve. Excuse me for one. Reading Hall. We're back in the Reading Hall. All right. So, let's, uh, let's look into our next mission. Again, it's, it's written down on a piece of paper. Task list. These two items do nothing together. I didn't mean to do that. Here we go. Task one. Lock of hair from the priestess of Lone Island. Check. That mission is done. Task number two. 
Griffin's egg from the mountains of Flyteria. All right then, let's uh, talk to Bort, our friendly neighborhood fellow Earth Mage. He can maybe give, give us some helpful advice. Initiation. My tasks were somewhat different from yours. Yeah, we've already we've already talked about that, Bort. I want to know anything new. News. The masters are looking to extend the initiation period to four days, up from one. That doesn't help you, though. All right. Uh, any gossip, Bort? I heard that a new home has been discovered in the tower. One the masters had not commissioned. Sometimes I think this place has a life of its own. All right. I want something else. Um. Elements. None can appreciate one's elements more than an earth mage. It is in our nature, if you'll pardon the pun. Ah, yeah. <laughs> good, good one there, Mort. You're a nature mage. All right, obviously there's nothing here. Is there anything I can talk to with Cray? Uh, Igno, um, Lake, Cray. Newly initiated water mage at your service. Well, um, <clears throat> Mr. Cray is a little bit more friendlier these days since I've returned him his uh, sapphire brooch. Water mage. Our motivations are clearest, our thoughts purest. Of course, you won't get such an admission from too many here. That's ignorance for you. All right. Uh, can you tell me about Shireen? She was my mentor. Now that I've learned all I can from her, I'm looking to more knowledgeable sources. Tell me about Master Estream. I have had the opportunity to speak with her on several occasions. She sees in me great potential. Great. Something else? That's about enough for now. All right, let's uh, let's go to fly. Let's go to our friendly neighborhood, our friendly tower. Uh, water mage, not water mage, air mage. Actually, what might be a good idea to go to the water mage and pick up uh, pick up some uh, water. You know, always good to have an extra bottle of water. Magic, it's mana water. You did it, Dark. Yes. What of the priestess? Oh my, I should, she should is talk as to her. I found her. Though many would have it otherwise, you did the right thing. Oh yes. Let's hope so. I made a moral decision. I did not kill her last episode, but I did disable her her dangerous ability, and I chopped off her lock of her hair. All right. Um. Don't have any bottles ready here. Okay, any, can I talk to uh, Shireen? Maybe she can be of assistance to me. Um, water spells. One should never forget that our magic is best when it is subtle. Know this, and your gift's true worth. Speech. To speak with the creatures of our element is to know our element better. Relish those opportunities. Jet. There can be no greater contribution than our element itself. Share the water with our world, and it will flourish for all time. All right, about well, something else. Post initiation. Have you given any thought to what you will do after your initiation? To be honest, not really. I thought I'd stay here a bit longer, maybe specialize in some area or another. Do you ever think about returning home? Sometimes. Most mages don't, though. That is true. Many view it as unnecessary. Ten years is a long time. Memories fade. Especially when influenced by our magic. It saves much heartache and allows both Chosen and their families to carry on with their lives. In theory. Uh, family. Do you miss your family, Dark? I miss... recalling their faces, their voices, what they were like, whether they laughed, things like that. You've coped well. I've been kept busy. And I'm grateful I haven't had to spend my life hauling Gollogs through the mud. They're the most stubborn creatures you could imagine. Gollogs. All the same, you may permit yourself some time to reflect on where you've come from. It's better to focus on what I'm doing and where I'm going. I don't need the distraction. It's too... 
<sighs> it's all right. The path of the chosen is not without its hardships, even if our pain is invisible to others. Regrets. Do you regret coming here, Dark? Why would you think that? Sometimes I see it in your eyes. A longing. Sure. To be initiated. It's more than that. You yearn for something. Something you had once, but have lost. If you're referring to my former home, leaving was neither my doing, nor within my control. You resent your lack of choice? Since when do the Chosen get to choose? Don't misunderstand me. I could not have loved my time here more. I just... wonder... How things might have been had your element not chosen you. Yes. But it did. And here I am. Uh, well, something else. Illusions. Illusions? Of course. Their fluidic nature has always intrigued our kind. I am sure there's a book in the... Re oh, I, I've already read that book. Any news? My most recently initiated student, Cray, is hoping to transfer to the Water Tower of Dominatra. Oh, yeah. I do not fancy his chances. Fierce does not begin to describe the competition there. Hmm. Gossip. Any gossip? I am not one to gossip. But I have heard a rumor that there may be a big event planned in the capital in the coming months. Hmm. That might be help. Might it be interesting in the future? Uh, take care. All right, we've we've done enough here. We don't have anything that we could use right now. We have some transparent fluidity potion, screaming tree sap. We don't need any of that right now. What we do need is we do need some more glass bottles but for now let's uh head back we're gonna we're going to go to the air mage we need to okay, that would be in the observation hall see if we can get some information about flyteria all right oh well this doorway I, I haven't tried this doorway so long as my arms don't get tired. I wonder what happens if I go through this door. Oh, apparently they're all doors that can go somewhere. What's this? Clutter. Jonas's filing system in action. What was that? A handprint might not improve the view. Oh, apparently I have some experience points to upgrade. Okay, what I have um, 181 experience. I'm level 3, which is awesome. Let's uh, build up our constitution and our strength as well as our magic. And let's work on a little bit more intelligence. Excellent. And let's look at our inventory. Can we identify some objects? Not right now. We don't need to identify much. But we are intelligent enough to do so and use these scrolls of identify. Pearl Perfection, 50% mana recovery speed, 50% armor, requires 6 base intelligence. I don't have enough. Ah, if I had a little bit more intelligence. Rough Aquamarine, plus 2 intelligence, pl nine, minus 1 strength. Smooth Torquewise, plus 1 strength, plus 1 intelligence, requires base 3 magic. Let's use that. Alright, at least I got that for now. We got a green gem plus one intelligence durability. Thirty-seven out of one hundred. All right, all right. Let's go. Uh, let's talk. Let's talk to Jonas. We need to talk to Jonas for some helpful advice.
You took care of the priestess, I see. Oh, yes. You saw? Mm. I watched everything. Excellent. I'm not sure whether I should feel grateful or disturbed. I watched everything. Why not both? <laughs> All right, let's talk a little bit more. Uh, initiation. Try not to worry too much about the tests. They are challenging, but they can also be a lot of fun. You just have to get through the life-threatening parts. Uh, elements. Imagine if there was a fifth element hmm. or sixth. Someone should write a fifth book about element. That. that sounds alchemical. Mage's tower. It has the best view in Iganor. Observation hall. Why go out into the world when you can see it all from here? Mages. Why? Do you know any? Um, uh, air mages. You can never have enough air. Trust me. Tell me about Jonas. You know me, always doing something productive, in a sense. Alright, something else. Tell me about the masters. Never see much of them. Then again, I do not see a lot of anybody. Few mages visit my observation hall. A pity. There is much to enjoy if you sit back and look. That reminds me, I must start keeping notes on my discoveries. Wonder what today's were. Arania. Tell me about Arania. We once enjoyed a long, stimulating chat about... Uh, well, it must have been memorable. About something else. Tell me about Dark. I know the name. Don't tell me. Uh, about something else. It's a bit of an absent-minded professor. Mages. Why? Do you know any? Uh, about something else. About something else. Uh, Mages Tower. It has the best view in Iganor. Something else. Tell me about Iganor. How could anyone overlook <coughs> this paradise? <coughs> Tell me about the telescope. I have more immediate matters to attend to. Something right now. Any news? It's difficult to come by these days. You visit my <coughs> observation hall. A pity, really. One learns much from viewing the world. Such as? I have a theory that the world may, in fact, not be flat at all, but roundish. Wow. Uh, what I know a... that, or this telescope needs a new lens. What a revelation. Gossip. <laughs> Through my observations, I can tell you the local bird life is having a productive spring. Oh, you wanted human gossip? Uh, check back with me later. What was something else? I uh, gotta fly. Keep your head in the clouds. How about your telescope? I should not cast magic indiscriminate. All right. How about I have more immediate matters to attend to. All right. I have to move on. Let's get back to the reading hall. <coughs> Let's save our progress so far. Griffin's egg. Bacteria. Save our game here. Bacteria <laughs> Quest. There's no one else who can talk to. <coughs> can Bort help us with anything else? Or else we're just going to get moving on. Um, see you later. Alright. Let's uh, head back out. Let's go outside to the Mage Tower exterior.
What did the crosswords say? Lake is left. Town is this way, and I can't read that properly. The signpost indicates the direction of the lake, mountains, town, and mage's tower. Mountains are this way. So we need to go to Flyteria. But let's uh, check out what's going on in the town. I may want to buy an extra bottle from our trinkets, a trinket seller, a sea long. <clears throat> um, I want to trade, and I would like to buy an empty bottle. Excellent. May even buy an extra bottle just to be extra careful, extra. You know, come in handy. All right, two extra extra bottles of water, and I may buy an extra medicine. And it'll come in come it'll come in handy. All right, and I wonder if we could save our progress as Flytoria quest because there's nothing else really new right now I'd like to you to give me some uh, give me a little bit of a fortune see long I hear you do good fortunes talk about a sales pitch give me a fortune I've heard you can tell the future mm. you have heard falsely I am not oh, a seer. Oh, you're not. Then what do you tell your customers? I look to what was and is and see what might be. Mm. Which is? Such observations are taxing. I thought as mm. much. I may have something to help with that. Okay. I'll make an offer. Um. Like I said, such observations are taxing. All right then, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll increase your, your wage a bit more. Let's make it make an op make an offer of four coins. The path to power lies on a knife's edge. All right, that is helpful advice. Save the game. Flyteria quest replace. All right, let's see here. Let's look, examine our enchanted dagger for the cutting of cursed hair. We already got that thing. That dagger is as sharp as it looks. If it's as magical as the priestess claims, then who knows what damage it could do. That's the dagger I picked up from the priestess's castle. It has a sweet but and sickly smell. The lock of hair. All right, let's save the game. All right, it's like the request. I have divined all I can from your future. All right then. That's all for now. Let's save our game. All right. What's happening in the tavern? Just curious. Maybe he can help Fend and the uh, two of them. Um, any news? To us, the best news is no news. Ignore has that in bucket loads. Oh. Gossip? It's true. I hear a lot of things. Interesting things. Interesting things. Goblins have been sighted around the forest edge. <clears throat> they normally don't come that close to town. Alright, interesting things. A has been seen over the town on okay. several occasions. All right then, that that's that's helpful. Okay. Watch your back out there. All right, save the game.
Alright. Let's head back up to the tower for a quick moment. We're going to pick up some more mages of water. Let's head back to the Fountain Hall. Let's pick up a couple of bottles of Mage's Water. <clears throat> buy item and buy one more now I've got two bottles of mage's water comes in real handy alright save the game let's head back outside I'm going to Flyteria Mage's Tower Exterior. It's very, this microphone is kind of challenging to hold it up to my mouth because it won't. I won't be able to hear. You won't be able to hear my spe speaking if I don't do this. So it's a bit challenging. May have to figure something else to do it. All right. One hundred and eighty one experience, which is good. Save the game. Play Terry Quest. Our overwrite game, yes. Let's head toward town let's head toward Plateria, the mountains. <coughs> Woodlands. And we've already been to the to this tree house, this up this uh hunter stand, we've already been there. We don't need to get anything from there. We do need to go to the mountains though. Save the game as <coughs> Zyteria Quest. Yes, over a game. Let's run there, okay? We've done enough walking. Move there quickly. Get it quickly. Don't waste time with the hornets. Alright. Oh, here we go. Uh, let's save the game. Flyteria quest. Replace. Overwrite game. What are these? Eagles. These two act as gatekeepers to the Flyterian mountains. Alright. These two act as gatekeepers to the Flyterian mountains. Can we just walk up there or can we speak to them? Who in their right mind would talk to a bird? Oh, that's right. An air mage. An air mage. Okay, let me go upstairs. Will they allow me to pass through? I should complete the first of my trials before heading into the mountains. Wait a second. I did complete the first of the trials. You mean to tell me I didn't finish it yet? Oh my gosh. Well, apparently I have to go back. I have to give the hair to the to um ah, I have to give the hair to uh, Shireen. That's what I neglected to do. Ouch! 
Aggressive ah. little pests? I didn't mean. I'd better give them a wide berth. I didn't mean to do that. Bumped into them. Head back out the woodlands. <clears throat> We have to get back to Shireen, and we have to give the the lock of hair to Shireen. That's the only way we're going to complete this quest. We need to get back to the fountain hall. Give the lock of hair to Shireen. Keep it safe. Okay, but that's the mission, right? I am pleased to see you undertaking your tests. I knew the first day we met that you would become a great mage. You seem happier now, more than I've ever known you to be. Remember, your influence should be as the tide upon the rocks. Subtle, yet persistent. Alright, take care. Maybe we can go to the uh, initiation room without help. Um, Hallowed Hall. You have returned, Initiate Dark. Chief of the Lock, your note. So far have proven your value to okay. This we accept the Lock of Hair as proof of your accomplishment. Oh, first quest done. Do not grow complacent. The most challenging tasks lie ahead. The priestess Amankul lives, despite your opportunity to dispatch her. Yeah. Mercy is a trait we encourage among all our castes. Stand tall in the knowledge that you represent us well. All right. Rest now, then turn your mind to the mountains, where you will need wits as sharp as the eyes that keep watch from there. All right then. Quest number one is co officially completed. It's elsewhere in the town of Ignor. Okay, this a we have a little bit of a <coughs> a cinema scene. <laughs> I love the animation. It's one of the drunkards. Who ben, who we'll goes there? Who's he? There's not you. Most. Yes. Ooh. I have some business, a business proposal for you, young lad. It's time to revisit the sphere of knowledge. All right. Apparently, this is what I needed to do before I went to the second quest. Flyteria quest, replace. 
Alright, let's head back to the training hall. <laughs> 